emergency alert system has been activated. The President of the United States has authorized an activation of the emergency alert system to warn the public of a national emergency. This is not a test. Repeat, this is not a test. In a moment, the President will speak on the air to deliver an emergency statement. This is a serious emergency. Please give your close attention to this alert and have your device audible for this message. If you do not receive all the information in this alert, you are putting your life at extreme risk. The alert will contain crucial information about the event and necessary actions to take. Currently, the President is preparing to speak on the air. Please stand by at this time. The President is now ready to speak on the air. Please direct your undivided attention to this alert now if you have not already. Ladies and gentlemen, citizens of America, I know you're all startled by this abrupt alert, but I need you to pay close attention. Our country is under a severe threat. A foreign nation, which is currently unknown, is carrying out a cyber strike on us, causing vital infrastructure and national stability to suffer. However, the offenders have found a means to break into the U.S. missile defense system and have acquired access to presidential launch codes, which have the capability of launching our entire nuclear arsenal. I believe this is the result of a compromised insider in our administration selling this knowledge for their own monetary gain. We are still investigating exactly how they manage that as of now. Nonetheless, all of America faces grave danger. The attackers intend to detonate all nuclear weapons stationed across the country within their silos, causing immense destruction and releasing massive amounts of fallout that will blanket the country in a lethal radiation. The entire government is working to shut down this operation, but if all else fails, you must be prepared. Move to the nearest fallout or underground shelter as soon as possible and bring as many supplies as possible, including non-perishable food, clean water, additional clothing, and a way for the government to communicate with you, such as a portable radio. If you cannot get to a fallout shelter, locate the most interior room of a building and put as much space between yourself and the outside world as possible. Windows should be avoided at all costs. Turn off all ventilation systems and cover all cracks in doors and windows to prevent radioactive fallout from entering your shelter. Due to the magnitude of this attack, it is unknown how long you will need to shelter. All residents should take these measures immediately. I deeply dread this, America. If we are successful in preventing this attack, we will issue a similar alert within 20 minutes. This is the final communication before either safety or doomsday. May God have mercy on our souls. Time until detonation. Five minutes. The emergency alert system will remain activated until it is deemed necessary for programming to transfer to radio transmissions only. You will be notified if this action will be taken. This is an attack warning. An attack warning means that a full-scale attack is taking place against the United States. All residents within the shaded area need to get to a fallout shelter immediately to protect yourself against dangerous radioactive fallout. 
Nuclear hazard markings on the map indicate blast areas. This event will cripple U.S. infrastructure and cause damage to power grids in affected areas. Warning. Warning. You do not have much more time to prepare and gather supplies. If you are close enough to the detonation area, portable radios will be the only way to receive updates from the government. The fallout projection map may not be accurate, so residents within 100 miles of any shaded area are advised to seek a fallout or other substantial shelter. The government is still attempting to stop this attack, but has not yet been successful. Wait until the all-clear has been given before exiting your shelter. Do not use your telephone. The lines should be kept open in case of an emergency. It is too late to evacuate if you live in an area that will be impacted by a nuclear explosion. The emergency alert system will be transferred to radio transmission. This transmission will be suspended until further notice, and all future alerts will be sent out over radio. Tune to 88.0 and 108.0 MHz to receive newly issued alerts for your area and the nation. Your government thanks you for your cooperation and participation.